What's up guys and welcome back to another Krusty video. Memo here. And your girl Emmy right here. And today we are doing another food review and it's something that just came out this month on the 1st of July. The Cheetos chicken sandwich from KFC. It's only in the KFC. Um, so we got it to try it out and see what's good. It actually has Cheetos inside it. Whoa. Yeah, we actually got the Cheetos lovers box and it comes with the sandwich. Cheeto <laughs> chicken like poppers, talking. wedges, and mac and cheese. Oh, we also got, uh, what's it, Sweet Lightning? Sweet Mountain Lightning Dew? Mountain Dew. It's sweet peach and sweet honey, I would believe. So the Sweet Lightning is only at KFC. Um, I so think it just came out too. Two limited editions out. Yeah, I, I don't know if it just came out like right now because we just found out about it today, but. I'm gonna lift up the sandwich so you guys can see it. It's pretty good. That's how it looks. It's uh, peach and honey, isn't it? The sweet lightning. And then here's the little. They didn't close the Chicken range, poppers. Right? Little chicken Cheeto poppers. Yeah, that's and how potato it looks. wedges. The Cheetos in Wait, there. Wait, what is this supposed to be? That's mac and cheese. Ooh. So that's, it's a chicken sandwich with. Uh, it has its own sauce, which is Cheeto sauce, I guess. And the Cheetos at the bottom. That sounds weird. Cheetos and sauce. no lettuce or anything. It has mayo in it, and that's pretty much it. So. All right, ready to hop Let's on. In. Hell yeah, I'm ready. I'm hungry. Mmm. That's pretty good. I mm, like the texture. Pretty bomb. And the cheese adds like. I don't know, it just adds the cheesy flavor and it's like really good. I like it. Uh oh. A couple of people have been saying that they're disappointed by it, but honestly, I like it. It's really good. Mm. Chicken's great too. Mm -hmm. It's not dry. I hate dry chicken. But it's like pretty greasy. It's a bad sign. But I mean, best was always greasy, so. It's fried chicken. So, what would you rate it out of five? Five? Yeah, I like it. I think I'd rate chicken this. Chicken is not dry. Five, no. It's like really. That's really juicy. juicy. Mm -hmm. I think I would rate it like. I want to give it like um, like a four or a three point five because it's good, but it's not like something that I want to like order again. I think I would actually order it again, but then again, I really like Cheetos. Yeah. Like I'm not the type of person who would be like, let me eat a bag of Doritos. I prefer to eat um, these Cheetos and Hot Cheetos. They're pretty good though. So maybe my review is biased. I don't know. It's good. You guys should go out and KFC and try yourself. I like the box. The box looks pretty sick. Now what would you rate the Mountain Dew? I like it. But I feel like there's like an aftertaste to the end of it. But I think that's the honey. The honey part. Because it's peach honey. Yeah, from what I was reading it was peach oh. honey. In the beginning, I said I liked it more than Baja Blast, which I know, mm -hmm. right? I hit that. Trader. No, and then that. I started drinking it too much, and I'm like, it's too sweet for me. But if I were to pick between Baja Blast and this, I would think I would want to drink this while I'm eating something. So I'm gonna move to these already because I'm starving. I just finished my burger. So these are just the uh, Cheeto chicken poppers. Potato wedges. Yeah, that's what you use potato wedges. And we'll see. Mm. I love potato. I don't know. Looks like I wanna like it, but. This one just tastes like a regular chicken popper. Yeah. Like it's 
Can I do some more? Cause there's sauce in there. There's some sauce in there. Mm -hmm. Um, I'm gonna have to give this um. I'm gonna give it like a three. I'm gonna give it a three because you can kind of taste it, but it's not like fully there. So I think I'm gonna have to give it a point off of this one. Because I can't taste the sauce on this. That's what I'm saying. Like, the only reason I gave it a five out of five in the beginning is because honestly, I would order this again because I really like Cheetos. I'm gonna ask them. I really like Cheetos. Can't ever eat Doritos or anything that's cheesier than that. Oh um, man, do my shirt. <clears throat> but yeah, I'll give this a three. Um, the burger, 3.5. And then, the thing I don't, the other thing I don't like is that it's probably the most greasiest food we've eaten. Like, look at my fingers, like, that's the most greasiest thing we've eaten ever. I feel, I don't know. Mm -hmm. It's like really, really greasy. But Now, what would you rate this though, like, in this whole package, like, this combo? But you'd like be like, oh yeah, hell yeah. Well, I don't know. Well, I said 3.5 and 3, so I would just give it a straight up 3. Because it's like, it's good, but it's not like the best thing in the world, you know? I, I feel like, if I had to choose my chicken and this, I would choose my chicken. Yeah, I was going to say that. If you're going to, really? I would choose that. You would choose this? Yeah, because I like Cheetos. It's good. Well, I'm going to try this, guys. I'm sorry I didn't try sooner. I was actually trying to eat my sandwich because I'm pretty hungry right now. And the wedges oh, are yeah. good, though. I don't like this one. Mm -hmm. Oh, there's popcorn chicken. Also, someone explain to me why the hell popcorn chicken is called popcorn chicken. Because you could just pop it into your mouth. It just doesn't make sense it's to like me. It's like popcorn. You could just go. I don't like popcorn. So what's your final rating? I kind of tasted the sauce in that one. Hold up, guys. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. I'm trying to be professional out here. You know what I'm saying? Not no wishy washy. <clears throat> Okay, now I could just it. So. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Yeah. Mm hmm. Okay, so this one that I got had more sauce. I actually liked it. The other thing when I got that was just popcorn chicken. Oh my god, I'm going back to that. Getting triggered. Tasted whatever to me. Now, when it has the sauce on it or you scoop it in more in the sauce, it kind of tastes a little gooder to me. But I would give this a 3 out of 5. This right here, I personally wouldn't go after. But all together, how much would you do it? Like for the sandwich and the, the popcorn? Like a 3.5. Oh, 3.5? Okay. Because this brings it down. The wedges are good. I haven't tried the mac and cheese, but I mean, mac and cheese is always a hit or miss. That's why I'm giving it a 3.5. Yeah. So, and this is after review. Um, let us know if you would want to try this. It did come out at the beginning of the month. I don't know when it's gonna when they're gonna take it out off of the out of the store, but you guys should go try it if you guys are curious. My hands are a little, you know. And while you're there, make sure to try out the Mountain Dew because it's pretty good. I what did I give it? I don't even remember what I gave. You didn't it. read it. I didn't read it. Oh, well, I would give it like uh, I think I'd give it the Mountain Dew like four. It's pretty good, but. Eat it with food. I'm not kidding. Yeah. You drink it, too sweet. With food. Anyways, guys, thank you for coming by. Uh, let us know what you thought <laughs> about our review. Sorry, guys. Uh, make sure to drop a like and clap the cheeks of that like button if you like this kind of content. And yeah, check out the links down below. Mm -hmm. And we're streaming. We got a stream schedule. It's right there. If we're not streaming, it's because I have homework. I am going to school. Mm -hmm. so yeah guys um thank you for stopping by we appreciate it and we'll see you guys on the next video bye i'm gonna get my potato wedges